the most impressive one at the moment um, is Google Veo 3, which uh, I was at Google I.O. in person this year, and they, and they were, they were a lot of rumors that they were announcing something big in the video space, and we weren't expecting it to be AI video, which also includes sound effects and music. That's a whole new other uh, like standard, because we were used to creating videos, and they were all silent. Silent, silent. Yeah, okay, so Google VO3, and yeah. what is the, for those who haven't used it yet, because not a lot of people have access to it, is it, is it open to the public? Right? It's now open to the public. You need a, I think you need to have a subscription, okay. as, as always now with these tools, but it is available. So which, if you want to create a video with Google VO3, what does it look like for the user? What are you actually doing? So it's right now is text to video, and what's really cool is that it's part of Google Gemini. So if you use Gemini already as part of your 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 flow for search or for writing, similar with ChatGPT, you can prompt it now to create Google Veo AI video kind of content now, which is super easy and accessible because in the previous versions of Google Veo, it wasn't that easy to get access to it. But this time they just went all out to make sure it's available to everyone. I think that's a really good step. You got it.